What's up guys? My name is Troy from Rastero Toyota here in West Bend and today we're just going to talk about a quick difference that a lot of people sometimes misthink um, or, or think one, one is another versus another. Long story short, do you know the difference between all-wheel drive and four-wheel drive? If you don't, that's okay. That's what we're here for. I'm going to explain it for you here today. But if you do, feel free to skip off this video and watch the next one. But regardless, we're going to talk about all-wheel drive versus four-wheel drive. Um, the big difference is one is automatic, one is manual. And basically what that means is for four-wheel drive, if you want all the wheels to be going and driving the vehicle, you need to switch it from a two-wheel drive option to a four-wheel drive option, whether it's four high, four low. Whereas all-wheel drive is automatic. So all-wheel drive is going to kick in whenever it's wet, whenever there's some slippage, right? So most, most all-wheel drive vehicles are front-wheel drive. So we'll take the Toyota Camry for an example. It's a front-wheel drive Camry. And as you're driving down the road, it's wet or snowing or whatever, and there's a little bit of slippage, it will then engage that back, those back tires to then start spinning. It's to get you out of sticky situations and keep you safer instead of you just sitting there and, and you know spinning, slipping, anything like that. Again, four-wheel drive, you have to, in a scenario where you get stuck or if you're, you know, we'll take a, a truck for an example, right? And those are rear wheel drives. So you're driving and your, your rear wheels get a little stuck. You actually have to go ahead and, and, and transition that into four wheel drive. Um, most of the time people would put it in four wheel high at that point. The big difference between four wheel high and four wheel low is four wheel high is gonna you know um, give you um, access to more horsepower whereas four wheel low is gonna give you more torque. Um, so low can be there to help you out of um, like if you're really, really stuck, put it in four wheel low, um, stuff like that. But in most cases, four wheel high is where you, you'd want to go. Um, so truthfully, that's really the big gist of it. That's about all that there is to say regarding it is all wheel drive is automatic, four wheel drive is manual. Um, and the other thing is, is that four wheel drive is permanent four wheel drive. So you can put it in four wheel drive and you can keep it in four wheel drive. Don't recommend that, but all wheel drive is only going to kick in. It's automatic. So it's only going to kick in when it's needed. That being said, guys, if you have any questions or you want to set up a time to come in and talk more about all-wheel drive vehicles versus four-wheel drive vehicles um, or any vehicles for that matter, feel free to give us a call at 262-334-9411. My name is Troy from Rustero Toyota. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thanks. Bye.